Hello and welcome to Physical Chemistry Exam Questions Part 1, Thermodynamics and Phase Equilibria. The first problem deals with the change in enthalpy and Gibbs energy during a process. Lime, that is calcium carbonate, may dissociate into ions in water. Calcium 2 plus ions and carbonate 2 negative ions. Determine the standard change in molar entropy, in molar Gibbs energy, and the equilibrium constant of this process. We consider the reaction's energetic and entropic aspects. First, we want to determine the entropy change during the process. We compute the entropy change of the reaction by forming the stoichiometric sum of the entropies of all substances involved. We end up in a positive reaction entropy change of about 33 joules per mole and Kelvin. The reaction therefore is endotropic. The products have a higher entropy than the reactants. Then we calculate the enthalpy change in a similar manner. The difference of the enthalpies of the products and the reactions. We receive a positive reaction enthalpy change of about 66 kilojoules per mole. Thus, the reaction is endothermic. The products have a higher enthalpy than the reactants. The Gibbs free energy of the reaction may be determined by the equation of Gibbs-Helmholtz. Delta G equals delta H minus T times delta S. We use the corresponding values, always in kilojoules, and get a positive Gibbs free enthalpy change of about 56 kilojoules per mole. Thus, the reaction is energonic at room temperature. G is a measure of instability. The pure reactants are more stable than the pure products. The equilibrium lies on the reactant side. To determine the exact value of the equilibrium constant, we may use this equation. The numerical value of the equilibrium constant is e to the negative 22.5 or 1.7 times 10 to the negative 10. The unit of the equilibrium constant, moles squared over liter squared, may be obtained by the law of mass action. In fact, it's the solubility product of lime. Thanks for watching.